guys, welcome back to Sunny Side Up Food Review. Today I wanted to review a couple different snacks, different frozen snacks. Um, this first one is Cinnamon Toast Crunch Bites. I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, that is so cool. Like, it's from the actual cereal. It describes itself as soft donut bites with a sweet cinnamon filling. So, I was like, oh my gosh, that is so cool. This says ready in 30 seconds, so you do have the option to microwave it, but I went ahead and put this in the oven. It says oven on 350 for eight minutes, because I figured that might come out a little bit better. So I did that. Um, this box in particular is a bit pricey because it is new, so it's $4.99 for this box. It may be cheaper, it just depends on where you go. So this is what it looks like. It's a nice, like, crispy top there. Very small, definitely, you know, like, bite size. Okay, so I'm gonna try it now. This actually isn't too bad. The filling is pretty interesting, actually. And it has a nice crunch to the outside. And then, let me see if I can show you guys the filling in there. See, it has a good layer of that uh, cinnamon filling spread stuff. And you get a sense of like the buttery, like a butter flavor from the crust. Definitely got a good amount of sweetness to it. And cinnamon flavor. So this is really good. This would be great with some ice cream. For sure, like, I definitely recommend buying this. So I would give this um, a four out of five. I would say it doesn't really remind me of a donut per se, even though, like, you know, the donut holes, those would be like donut bites. It doesn't really have that type of vibe, but I mean, it's just, it's good, so. I mean, that's the most important. It <laughs> just tastes like good. <laughs> Okay, moving on to these Doritos, Doritos Loaded. Now, I've seen these for a while in the grocery store, but I was just um, slightly grossed out, so I didn't want to buy it. Like, it just didn't look appealing or seem appealing. <laughs> I was like, um, <laughs> but I thought it would be cool to do a review video. I know everyone loves Doritos. I love Doritos. just wasn't sure about this thing, so... <laughs> But I was like, I gotta try it. I mean, it is new, so I gotta try it. So this is the newest one. It's the Cool Ranch flavor. And then they have the nacho cheese flavor. So, huh, I don't know where I'm gonna start. I'll just go for nacho cheese. I went ahead and put this in the oven as well. You're supposed to bake this for eight minutes. These were also, I believe, $4.99 per box. So they were a bit pricey, but... This is the Dorito. I'm gonna try it now. This isn't bad, actually. Um, I don't quite know, though. Like, it just seems like it's fried cheese, basically. Um, which I guess could work for a lot of people because you know you buy like mozzarella sticks, so fried mozzarella sticks, so that's basically just fried breading with cheese inside. I do get notes of the actual Dorito chip with this, and then it just has the cheese filling. It doesn't super duper taste like a Dorito, but you know, it's got that vibe. You can even see little, little pieces of it, sort of like it's within the batter a little bit. But I'm just getting like a fried cheese kind of good, you know, thing. I wouldn't buy it again, but it's not it's not bad. It's definitely not as bad as I thought it would be um, when I first saw it, you know. So, rating wise, I would give this like a 3 out of 5. I wouldn't buy it again. But I can see people liking this. The flavor on it is not bad. Definitely is not bad. The outside has a slight crunch to it, you know, especially if you um, put it in the oven first. 
and the cheese on the inside is actually really good and it's a pretty um thick layer of cheese you can see that's the outside and it's got a good you know good amount of cheese in there okay on to the cool ranch one and this is that one here and they both look like they do on the box too which is <laughs> pretty cool okay this one's filling isn't as cheesy it's more of like a white cheese and the layer is not as thick it's probably hard to see on this piece but i can tell it's not as thick as definitely not as thick as with the other one let's see if you guys can tell this one's definitely thinner I definitely get a cool ranch vibe from this immediately. And the cheese flavor inside sort of is similar to string cheese, like a melted string cheese vibe with that one. And it works really well though with this outside. Hmm. So this is one that isn't too bad. I would give this Maybe like a four out of five, because I feel like I actually slightly like this better. But you know, it's one of those debate things, like as far as the chips are concerned, I still can't decide which one I would really pick over the other one, because it just kind of depends on what you're in the mood for, like if you want the cool ranch or the nacho cheese. I love both of them, it just depends. <laughs> but, um, so as far as picking one of these, like if I had to buy one again, I would pick, um, I would say the Cool Ranch, like I definitely enjoyed that more, of course, <laughs> can tell by the rating. <laughs> I enjoy that more, and um, but as far as buying either of them again, I wouldn't, but um, I would, I definitely prefer this Cool Ranch, so Cool Ranch is the winner in the Doritos battle for this video, <laughs> for sure. Um, but yeah, I would, I would say these are... Definitely not as bad as I thought, so they proved me wrong. So, um, so yeah, that is all for this review. Definitely head out to the stores and buy some if you're interested in trying them. You might even be able to find it on a sale or cheap, you know, depending on where you go. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and hit the like button, and I will have more review videos up for you guys soon.